Air Force. We hope you enjoyed today's show as much as we enjoyed performing it. Come meet the team at our set in the blue shopping mall. We'll have posters to sign. And remember, we look forward to your comments, photos, and uh, videos on our Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram pages. Use our hashtag CF18Demo. And now back to your air show announcer, Ben. Thank you so much to Jen and all of the CF-18 demo team for their contribution to RAF 100. The value of air power became increasingly apparent during the years of the First World War. It led to calls in the United Kingdom for an independent air force. The Royal Flying Corps has been formed in April 1912. The Royal Naval Air Service separated from it in 1914. The RFC's initial role was developed, so did the scope of their operations. Despite many hardships, the RFC and the RNAS became very effective and increasingly well-trained fighting forces. The value of the aeroplane at war was increasingly not in doubt. During 1917, in the wake of raids against London by German Gotha G4 heavy bombers, South African General Jan Spuss, a member of the War Cabinet, was asked to conduct a review of Grenon's Great War Display Team. This display, incidentally, will include pyrotechnics being fired from the ground. It's all part of the show. And the first two aircraft that we see in front...